Elite Facts presents the biggest bodybuilders of all time, 60. He's the youngest ever Mr. Olympia winner, winning the first of seven times when he was just 20 and also adding four Mr. Universe titles as well. He didn't stop there though. He's been a demigod, a warrior, a cyborg, a general, a teacher, a hero, a villain, a dad, and expendable. Phew. Unless you've lived your life under a rock, you'll know this man. Arnold Schwarzenegger is easily the most recognizable face to have ever competed in bodybuilding, setting records from the start. All this and he was also the governor of California. That's a serious rap sheet. 15. Ronnie Coleman has set the bar for the entire bodybuilding world forever. He has a weight that sticks around 300 pounds, which is the weight of a panda. Coleman began life as a football player and his muscle was intended to help his game. He also had aspirations to become an accountant. He has to be good with numbers to tally up his weights, we bet. He then moved to become a cop and it was there he found out about a gym and lifting weights. The rest is history. His record is actually a world record, holding the most titles for any pro builder at 26 and eight of those are Mr. Olympia's. He's truly a wondrous competitor. 14. Jay's strengths are simple to point out. In the day of the Giants, he has it all and still manages a streamlined midsection and a razor-sharp aid pack. He has superior calves, freaky biceps, and great overall balance. He spent a large part of the early noughties coming a close second to Ronnie Coleman in the Mr. Olympia before upping his regime and winning it four times in five years from 2006. 13. Kai Green used weights as an outlet from a rough time as a youth, and the discipline and dedication involved has really helped him. When he turned pro at 18, he was the youngest natural bodybuilder ever. Kai's admirable determination paid off almost 16 years after he first entered the bodybuilding circuit when he became one of the buff athletes in the IFBB professional ranks. He has a personal beef with Bill Heath but there's no real reason why. But it never ends in anything other than some good old fashioned smack talk. What a fight it would be though. 12. We add another German to the list here with Gunter Schleierkamp. He started training at 16 and entered and won his first competition at 18. He won the Mr. Universe title in 1993. It's his likeness to the cartoon character Johnny Bravo and his charismatic smile that has got him acting and modeling work as well as his weightlifting career. 11. In the big worldwide, Lou Ferrigno is more famous for his stint playing the Incredible Hulk on TV during the 1980s. Hulk smash! It took Lou a while to get into bodybuilding. A hearing disability made it difficult for him to interact with others and he spent all his time reading comic books. He started at age 12 and never looked back, becoming the youngest man ever to win the Mr. Universe title twice. Add that he is also the youngest to ever enter Mr. Olympia, and you can sense his desire. Just don't make him angry. 10. There's no bigger prize in the world of bodybuilding than Mr. Olympia, and Lee Haney has won it an incredible eight times in a row. It was in the 80s that Haney dominated the circuit and has since put his knowledge and expertise to good use. He owns two gyms that train professional athletes and also runs a nonprofit charity for underprivileged children. What a great guy. 9. The man known as The Gift, Philip Heath, is a legend in the bodybuilding world. He was an excellent basketball player and got a scholarship to play it at Denver. It was in 2002 he started to get into bodybuilding and won a whole load of titles before he began his amazing run of winning Mr. Olympia four times over his career. His body is naturally gifted in the mold of a perfect bodybuilder. 8. Johnny O. Jackson is an absolute beast. And despite being only 5'8", he holds a world record for deadlifting an insane 760 pounds. For reference, that's a young adult moose. Close. 
Add to that an incredible 600 pound bench press and you can see why he's known as a monster. He's also a former military man and says it helped him with the discipline needed to lift. 7. Another German born builder on the list, Dennis James was actually raised in America when his father was stationed there. Maybe it's the Germanic bloodline that gives them the bodybuilding desire, or maybe it's what they feed them over there. But James kept up his physique for many years and has a best place finish of fourth in the Mr. Olympia competitions. Six. Okay, so Mustafa Ismail might not be naturally muscle bound like the others, but we like his audacity. He actually holds a Guinness Book World Record for biggest bicep and triceps, but purists will point out the fact that he is filled with synthol. Synthol is a liquid product that is pumped into people to give the illusion of mass. It's basically cheating. His guns are 31 inches in size, and he says he can lift 600 pounds, but nobody has seen him do it, and he has never competed on the bodybuilding stage either. 5. Kevin Lavrone started bodybuilding at 11, and it was due to his older brothers doing it. The coveted Mr. Olympia Award has always just evaded Lavrone having placed in the top five countless times. He competed well into his 40s, but has since retired. But he'll always be remembered by those in the business. 4. The German Nightmare. Imagine meeting someone called that. But Marcus Rule is known as one of the nicest guys on the circuit. He first lifted a dumbbell at age 19 and weighing 140 pounds. That's about the same as a big dog. <coughs> He now weighs 100 pounds more than this and is more like a lion. He has the heart of a lion too, winning his first two competitions in Germany and continues to pack on the muscle and compete now. 3. Another who falls into the category of excellent symmetry is Flex Wheeler, nicknamed the Sultan of Symmetry. His real name is Ken, but that doesn't quite have the same ring to it. Flex has been around since 1993 and won the coveted Triple Crown in 1997. That's the Ironman, Arnold Classic, and the San Jose Classic. 2. You might think it's a funny surname, but if you're tempted to giggle at Raleigh Winklar, you would do well to remember he's just 5'6", but weighs in at 285 pounds, and all of it is muscle. He plays first in his debut competing and hasn't looked back since. His physique is widely known as one of the most symmetrically aesthetic and could become bodybuilding's next big name. One. First up is Dennis Wolf, a Russian native who you wouldn't want to meet in a dark alley when you see his intimidation face. Like so many builders, Wolf started off at the age of 15 pumping the iron when he read a magazine of his father's and he was soon competing by the time he was 21. He shows no signs of slowing down or getting any smaller as he continues to work on his physique. He's built up an incredibly impressive size and one thing's for sure, whatever this big bad wolf wants, he probably gets. Thanks for watching another amazing video folks. Subscribe for more from Elite Facts.